Hi there, in this video I'm going to show you how to calculate the vector AB using uh, the position vectors of A with respect to the origin and the vector B with respect to the origin. So I'll show you how to work out the vector AB using the vectors OA which is the position vector of A with respect to the origin and OB which is the position vector of B with respect to the origin. Okay, so in this case, let me draw um, a set of axes. So axes. So so this is my i, j, and k uh, axis in the direction o x, o y, and o z. Okay, and supposing. If I have two points A and B, okay, and if they're denoted by vectors A and B relative to the origin O, okay, let me show you how to calculate the vector AB. So in this case, the vector OA, so vector OA is the position vector of A with respect to the origin, if that is given by A, okay, and if I also have the vector OB, the position vector of B relative to the origin, and if that's given by the vector B, okay, let me show you how to calculate AB, the vector AB. So the vector AB will be the vector AO plus the vector OB. So it's going to be the vector AO plus the vector OB. Okay. So remember, since vectors have direction, to work out the vector AO, AO will be minus of OA. Okay, so remember, vectors not only have size, they've got direction as well. So vector AO will be minus vector OA. So in the same way, vector BO will be minus the vector OB. Okay, so in this case, I could rewrite this as AO, which is minus OA, plus the vector OB. Okay, so I hope you can see that. Okay, and the vector OA is given by small a, okay, plus the vector OB given by small b, which is the same as writing the vector B minus the vector A. So the vector AB will be the vector B minus the vector A. Okay, now when I, when I look at this, I always think to myself, in order to work out the vector AB quickly, so to work out the vector AB quickly, it's always O of the second letter, so it's always O of the second letter minus O of the first letter, okay? So if you look at this equation over here, okay, that I've written down, so remember, currently it's minus OA plus OB, and I could rewrite that as vector OB minus vector OA okay but remember what I said earlier to think about it quickly vector AB will be O of the second letter so the second letter is B minus O of the first letter first letter is A so the vector AB will be OB minus OA okay in the same way supposing if you want to work out the vector GH GH will be O of the second letter here, second letter is H, minus O of the first letter, first letter being G. So vector GH is OH minus OG. Okay. Same thing if you have a vector uh, to if you want to calculate rather the vector XY, XY will be O of the second letter here, which is Y, minus O of the first vector, which is X. Okay, so that you can do if you're given the vectors O, H, O, G, 
okay, to work out GH and this you can do if you're given the vectors OX and OY, okay? So let's try an example. So let's try an example on the reverse. So with example number one, Oops, so I hope you can see that. So in example number one, supposing if you're given the vector OA, if that's given by 2i, okay, uh, plus j, uh, plus 6k, so I'm just making up this example, and supposing if you've got a vector OB, if that is given by 2i, plus 3j plus 9k okay so if you have these two vectors OA and vector OB question is to calculate the vector AB so remember using the idea the quick idea vector AB is going to be okay O of the second letter so second letter here is B minus O of the first letter, first letter here is A. Okay, so it's O of the second letter B minus O of the first letter A, so OB minus OA. So if we substitute our vectors given in, OB, that is given by 2I plus 3J uh, plus 9K minus Vector OA that is given by 2i plus j plus 6k. Okay, and if we add the like terms, 2i minus 2i is nothing, 3j minus j is 2j, and 9k minus 6k is 3k. Okay, so that completes that example. That is the vector AB. Okay, let's try another one. So uh, in example two, let me underline this. Supposing if I'm given uh, the vector OG, so if OG is I plus 5J plus 2K, And if I have another vector OH, if that is given by um, 2i plus 7j plus 3k. And if the question is to calculate, so calculate the vector uh, GH. So remember, to work out the vector GH, the quick idea, it's O of the second letter appearing, which is H, minus O of the first letter, which is G. Okay, so OH is 2I plus 7J plus 3K, minus, so these are vectors, minus OG, which is I, plus 5j plus 2k so once again if you add the like terms so 2i minus i is i 7j minus 5j is 2j and finally 3k minus 2k is k Okay, so that completes that example and that ends this video. So I hope you found this video helpful and I hope to see you in the next video. Thank you.